Hello everyone, Donnell HD here, and today I'm going to show you how to set up, configure, and install the Atari Jaguar and Atari Jaguar CD emulator Big P MU on LaunchBox. As per usual, I have my arcade folder here, and inside that folder I have my emulators folder, my LaunchBox folder, and the ROMs folder where we're going to be keeping our ROMs. I left the link in the description below for everything that you're going to need to get set up right away. All you have to do is click here on download. Alright, I've downloaded my Atari Jaguar Necessities file and I've placed it here on my desktop. What I'm going to do now is extract the contents of it into the emulators folder. Now we're going to launch the emulator for the first time. I'm going to go into emulators, Big P MU, and the Big P MU EXE here. Okay, upon opening it, you're going to see this screen. If you're using the Xbox controller, it's already pre-configured, or you can press S on your keyboard. So I'm going to press A now. Now we're going to go to settings. I'm going to go to CD BIOS image here. Select it. Select the BIOS folder here. And then the BIOS Word Atari Jaguar CD here. Now it is also set up to play Atari Jaguar CD games as well. I'm going to go back one, back twice, now I'm going to go to input. If you need to configure your controller at all, you can configure it in here by selecting input device one or two. Now I'm going to go back and I'm going to go to exit here. Now it's time to set this emulator up in LaunchBox. Okay, now that we're here in LaunchBox, we're going to go up here to the top left corner here. We're going to go to tools, manage, emulators gonna click add the name of our emulator is big P M U never gonna set the path my path once again is on the desktop arcade emulators big P M U and the big P M U E X E here now we're gonna go to associated platforms and make sure that you have Atari Jaguar here and if you're using Atari Jaguar CD platform as well make sure you have that here as well I'm going to check both of these to make sure that they're my default emulator. Now I'm going to go to the running script area. And I left the script in the description below that if you require it, you can escape out of the emulator easily by pressing the escape key. I'm going to paste that here. Now I'm going to click OK. And then close. Now it's time to import our games. OK, I'm doing the drag and drop method here again. So I'm going to go down here to my ROMs folder. Now I'm going to drag the Atari Jaguar ROMs folder into LaunchBox like so. What type of game files are we importing? Click ROM files. What platform are we importing games for? Make sure you select Atari Jaguar. When you import the Atari Jaguar CD platform, make sure you select the correct one. Next. Manually configure emulator. What emulator would you like to use? Make sure it says Big P MU here. Click next. Use files in the current location. Next. Next, next, next. Make sure your games are spelled correctly and then click finish. Okay, while I'm still here, now I'm going to import my Atari Jaguar CD platform. So I'm going to grab my ROM folder here, Atari Jaguar CD, and drop it in the launch box like so. What type of game files are you importing? ROM files. What platform are you importing games for? Make sure you select Atari Jaguar CD. What emulator would you like to use? Big P MU. Next. Use files in the current location. Next. 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 Make sure your games are spelled correctly and then click finish. Okay, we have successfully set up, configured, and installed the Atari Jaguar CD emulator, Big PMU, on LaunchBox. Thank you everyone for watching. If this video helped out at all, support the channel and drop a like and subscribe. I've created many tutorials for other platforms as well. Just follow the thumbnails on the screen. As always, I'm Don LHD, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Take care.